So, uh, yeah, you should. So, do uh, what do your teammates say about uh, your your modeling, your 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 turn on shows? Mm -hmm. You well, got you got the cucumbers in the eyes. The Brazilian wax next. What? Well, come on, man! <laughs> nah, I'll do all that, nah, but uh, I mean, they know I'm uh, into uh, my female audience and stuff, so they joke around with me. But hey, they can only be envious. It's only know? jealousy. Yeah. It's all love. You said that uh, on on that show you take turn on that aggressive girls are a big turn off. What's what's the most aggressive thing a girl's done to get your attention? <laughs> man, some basically is grabbing me, man. I mean, I'm talking about almost like like taking advantage of I'm a guy, and she's a girl. Like you know, if it was the other way around, I, I would be going to jail if I was doing what she did. To me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So. I was like, wow, I wish I had to put her in check. Like, you know, like I got a club, you know, stuff like that, like grabbing. Like, come on, man, are you for real? But, uh, you know, that don't really happen too much anymore. I, I pretty much give them the looks, the girls stay away. Like, man, like, he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna <laughs> let me come up on him, just grab him. Obviously. You do one wrong thing, you're on the news for the wrong reason. Right, you already know. Um, going back to last year, uh, Sherman, Sherman Zorn said that it was the execution, not the play calling, mm -hmm. that was the problem with the offense. You agree with that? Um, I mean, at times, obviously, I think we were were an undisciplined team, but I think that stems back from just the foundation of our team. You know, uh, the way things, the standards were set. I mean, there's a lot of, you know, things going on where people were getting away with stuff or not, you know, take care of their business. So I think that's changed. You know, we got a new coach Shanahan not gonna play that stuff. You know, he's not gonna allow guys to get away with stuff that they shouldn't get away with. Have you had a chance to talk to him about what your role is going to be next year? Yeah, he actually pulled me aside uh, yesterday and um, just looked at me and told me, hey, man, we're going to move you around and make sure we put you in great situations. So just make sure you learn the playbook and be on top of it. So I definitely, you know, was proud of that and happy that he, he looks at the situation for me like that. And I'm, I'm going to step up. So. Who do you think is going to be that slot guy now that Randall L's gone? Well, the way the from what I see on the offense, man, the way they got us moving around so much, I mean, I, I could honestly say it could be anybody. Um, I mean, size-wise, you would love to say Santana just because he fit that mold, but, man, our offense, I think now is going to be due to, like, just putting you in the right position to get the ball. Yeah. And, you know, one of the big pain for fans last year was the return game. And, yeah. And was that, was that Zorn or Danny that – because obviously you want to be back there, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And, and Zorn kept saying it was his call, but I mean, at the same time, we all know what Randall L really couldn't do, and mm -hmm. why wouldn't you, you know, why not put you back there, or D Hall, or? Yeah, uh, I mean, that was Coach Zorn's call, obviously. Uh, I don't know, I guess he just felt he had the confidence of Randall L still, and, and like I said, I, 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 it was a situation where I know Randall L had talked to Zorn about being back there, and I guess, you know, like I said, a uh, lot of guys was able to go to Zorn and talk to him, and either do stuff or not do stuff, so. So he's paying them off. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. So if you're back there, then when you catch it, you'll do one spin move and fall down? <laughs> yeah, just don't get hit by anybody. <laughs> nah, man, I definitely know my mentality. I'll go, go hard, man. I'm not gonna, no fear back there. So what have you done? What, what have you done this all season? Any, do you work with anybody or just hanging out? Yeah, I was, uh, I was uh, out in Miami actually training for about a month uh, with uh, Pete Barmarino out there. And uh, yeah, man, I was just working hard. Man, there's a lot of other guys out there from around the league, but you know, I was focused just getting stronger and faster. You know, so get ready. To, I want to come into shape and not be out of shape. So. Nice. Yeah. All right, man. Thanks. Good. No problem.